I am going to show you how to prep the glockenspiels for our uh, level four students who are about to receive them. So we have a box of glockenspiels right here, um, but they all need a little bit of prep before we can hand them out to the students. So here's how we do that. You'll just open up uh, each box and there's a couple of things that we need to do to each glockenspiel. So inside the box will be a glockenspiel that looks like this. And there are gonna be a couple extra bars here that are either gonna be loose in the box or they're gonna be here um, where they're typically stored or um, sometimes they package them by just putting these extra bars right on top of the other bars. So if there's if there's two bars that have two on them, take off the B flat and the F sharp and just please put them in this basket here um, and we will use them later on. That way the kids don't keep them when they don't need them and end up losing them before we actually do need them. So take off those bars. Then the next step is to grab one of these little stickers here, which I have a pile of, um, and you will want to, with a Sharpie, put a capital C on the big white circle, and then a capital A on the little white circle, and then the student's name on the Kinder Music sticker. And then what you're gonna do with that is you will take those off uh, and put that on, just put the C on high C. There are two C's, but make sure that that one goes on high C. And then the little A needs to go, little A sticker needs to go on note A right there. And you could put it on the right way. I put it on sideways. Um, so uh, that's what needs to happen with that. And then with the Kinder Music sticker, you need to grab that and we need to put it on the side of the glockenspiel. So glockenspiels are situated when a child is playing them with the uh, short bars on their right, the high sounds on their right, um, low sounds on their left. So we just wanna make that easy for the kids to make sure that they're positioning the glockenspiel the right way. So we put the Kinder Music sticker on this side of their glockenspiel so that they know whenever they're gonna play, they need to be able to see the Kinder Music sticker so that they don't set it up backwards. Um, it needs to be situated this way. So this also has their name on it um, so we know whose is whose. And then just stick it back in the box, uh, in each box, and then if you could please also write their name um, on uh, on their box, on the outside of their box. So I have class lists here for this year, um, two class lists. And so uh, you'll do the same thing for both classes and then put those glockenspiels back in that big box there. Um, and you can just leave these extra bars up on the counter and any extra stickers can go on the counter as well. So there are, for this year, there's about 15 glockenspiels that need to be prepped. And um, the mallets are just loose in the box, which is fine. I think the instructors will uh, work with those a little bit separately. So just leave those loose in the box uh, for now. If there's any that are still in the glockenspiel, take them out and put them in the box with the other ones. So let me know if you have any questions. Appreciate the help. Thanks.